talking about art and describing art is really, really, really difficult when you're making it because Especially you Especially when you're a visual person. Yeah. <laughs> you have to kind of articulate it to make it to, you know, convey your ideas to the public. And, and you constantly feel like you're not articulating it enough. It's like, I have this huge idea and I can't quite tell you exactly what I'm trying to do. And I, I think that's where the artist has to let go and where the viewer has to come in and make it their own. That gap between where you can express what you're doing and where you can't anymore. There's a, there's a really important aspect to the, the class that this is for, contemporary issues. We're supposed to be like developing, quote unquote, our studio practice, continuously make art and be thinking through our pieces. And I think that even though sometimes this project, especially for those of us who are more in charge of ma mass making, um, it, while it's got stressful, it was also a really good way to keep our studio practice up um, and to be con continuously making, and not only continuously making, but continuously making things that weren't quite relevant for what we were supposed to be doing in our studios, but still helped us grow and kind of gave us an outlet for just the regular creativity that an artist has to have and has to develop. We're all in classes together all day, all week, and so we have a constant dialogue. And we're pulling in themes from other classes, we're pulling in methods and materials. I mean, like, I'm taking a mold making class with Andrea, and at the beginning of the project, um, Andrew and I made plaster donuts because I had just learned to make plaster. So it's sort of um, a lot less pressure than making a bunch of really sustained paintings or sculptures. I think that I definitely came in and I think that a lot of other people came into it with not a real lot of knowledge about what the, the class was supposed to be, more thinking that I was just going to go in Friday morning, we were going to look at slides and talk about art. But I think it's done what it was supposed to do, which was make us think about contemporary art and think about how that relates to us. I don't know, training ground in some ways, like learning, you know, like the technical aspects of things. So to get to, you know, have to organize our own show and like have our own ideas that are, yeah. you know, we're, we're, I mean, we're just doing it right now. So it's, it's not the same thing as like um, doing a painting you know, based on some old master or going outside and doing landscapes or something. It's, it's sort of more personal in a lot of ways.